How to make homemade meat rice pilaf, delicious and affordable Turkish dish for beginners. Merhaba, everyone. Welcome back to our multi recipes and cookeries channel kitchen. Today, we're diving into the world of Turkish cuisine, and I'm going to show you how to make a mouthwatering dish that's both delicious and budget friendly, homemade meat rice pilaf. So, let's roll up our sleeves and get cooking. Before we get started, let's take a look at the ingredients you'll need for this amazing Turkish dish. 1. Rice, 1 cup. 2. Ground meat, beef or lamb, half pound. 3. Onion, 1 large, finely chopped. 4. Garlic, 3 cloves, minced. 5. Tomato, 1 medium-sized, diced. 6. Green bell pepper, 1, diced. 7. Red bell pepper, 1, diced. 8. Olive oil, 2 tablespoons. 9. Butter, 2 tablespoons. 10. Chicken or beef broth, 2 cups. 11. Tomato paste, 2 tablespoons. 12. Cumin, 1 teaspoon. 13. Paprika, 1 teaspoon. 14. Salt, to taste. 15. Black pepper, to taste. 16. Fresh parsley, for garnish. Segment 1. Preparing the ingredients. Now that we have all our ingredients, let's start by preparing them. Begin by washing the rice thoroughly and set it aside. Chop the onions, garlic, tomatoes, and bell peppers finely. This will help the flavors blend seamlessly in our pilaf. Great! Now that our vegetables are ready, let's move on to the next step. Segment 2. Cooking the meat. In a large pan, heat 1 tablespoon of olive oil over medium heat. Once hot, add the finely chopped onion and minced garlic. Sauté until the onions become translucent. Now, let's add our ground meat. You can use either beef or lamb, depending on your preference. Cook the meat until it's browned and cooked through. Once the meat is cooked, add the diced tomatoes and bell peppers. This will add a burst of color and freshness to our pilaf. Segment 3. Building flavor. To enhance the flavors of our pilaf, let's add 2 tablespoons of tomato paste. This will bring a rich and tangy taste to the dish. Now, it's time to season our meat mixture. Add cumin, paprika, salt, and black pepper according to your taste preferences. Give it a good stir to ensure the spices coat the meat and vegetables evenly. Segment 4. Rice and Broth. Next, let's add the washed rice to the pan. Stir it well to combine with the meat and vegetables. Now, pour in 2 cups of chicken or beef broth. This will cook our rice to perfection and infuse it with savory goodness. Segment 5. Simmering and Fluffing. Bring the mixture to a boil, then reduce the heat to low, cover the pan, and let it simmer for about 15 to 20 minutes or until the rice is cooked and the liquid is absorbed. Once the rice is cooked, turn off the heat and let it sit, covered, for an additional 5 minutes. This allows the rice to steam and become fluffy. Segment 6. Finishing Touches. To add a touch of richness, melt 2 tablespoons of butter and drizzle it over the pilaf. Finally, garnish our homemade meat rice pilaf with freshly chopped parsley. It adds a pop of color and a burst of freshness. And there you have it, folks a delicious and affordable homemade meat rice pilaf that's perfect for beginners. Ingredients and preparations methods are in the description box. It's a taste of turkey right in your own kitchen. I hope you enjoyed cooking with me today. If you did, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe our multi recipes and cookeries channel for more tasty recipes, and let me know in the comments if there's anything else you'd like to see. Thank you very much meat rice pilaf lovers.